the rise of AI, uh, in particular Gen AI, is really a seminal transformational event for both enterprises and consumers. Uh, we believe that right now, um, every enterprise can benefit uh, from adopting uh, AI. And as we know, uh, there's a, there is a phase or there's a process of evolution. In fact, Jeffrey Moore talks about uh, AI adoption in three steps. Phase one is more about kind of the operational phase where enterprises use the power of AI uh, to automate repetitive tasks, to improve and drive operational efficiency everywhere. Uh, phase two uh, is really more um, uh, what we would call as infrastructure, where you're actually linking together the power of LLMs that have global internet-based information and link it with company or domain-specific information, right? So that becomes a RAG or a retrieval augmented generative AI, right? And that becomes even more powerful for a given enterprise or a given company. Phase three is what uh, he calls as uh, kind of the business phase, right? Where true new business models actually get developed through the power of AI, Gen AI, RAG, as well as a global infrastructure. And what we believe is that Ariaka as a company and networking and security broadly as an industry have a very significant role to play in both the evolution and adoption of AI, but also in using AI as part of uh, the networking and security industry itself. So let me talk about that. So at Ariaka, we see uh, uh, you know, uh, two sides of the same coin. One side says, hey, um, networking and security, you should use AI to improve uh, the efficacy of the security products, to link things together, to find anomalies, to drive the observability, right? So that's uh, all of uh, the security and networking industry players, including Adyaka, are using that. The second side of the coin is how can you actually leverage um, uh, the security and networking capabilities to actually make AI more broadly available in a scalable, uh, in a reliable, and in a global fashion? So that's one of the aspects that we have right now taken on and um, uh, actually um, uh, brought forth into the marketplace. Okay? But before I talk about Ariaka itself, let me talk about what role networking and security play can play in the world of AI. So the first is um, uh, networking itself, right? providing global access to GPU as a service data centers or AI as a service um, software as a service uh, equivalent offerings, right? And making that available globally in a high performant, in a very resilient fashion, so that any enterprise user anywhere in the world can access those AI as a service applications. So that's number one, that's networking. Second is uh, security. So in security, right, uh, we believe there are uh, three fundamental ways uh, in which uh, networking, uh, and uh, networking and our companies like Ariaka can play a role. The first is access control. So typically, an enterprise may have signed up with a particular AI as a service company. How can you take what was previously known as CASB or Cloud Access Service Broker and add on top elements around access control for a given user authentication to a particular enterprise subscribed kind of LLM uh, or AI as a service? So that's uh, kind of the first one. The second is uh, what you would, I would call as a threat detection, right? So clearly, um, with the ability to look at very large number of variables uh, and to be able to determine where there might be a threat uh, based on kind of the vulnerabilities in the system or the attack surfaces, uh, it's possible to find, uh, do things such as threat hunting, right? Uh, through uh, all of the AI techniques. So these are examples of uh, what you would see as threat detection enhancements uh, using AI in the world of networking and security. The third is uh, what I'm starting to call as knowledge loss prevention. As you know, there was a, there's a whole area of data loss prevention. That's one thing. But now with AI, there's a significant amount of company knowledge company-specific information that is out there in AI as a service uh, offerings or when you access an LLM over the internet. So how do you make sure that um, your data, your knowledge is not leaked?
through things such as prompt injection attacks, right? So we are uh, very carefully uh, building a series of products and services that can enable enterprises to leverage the power, the transformative power of AI in a much more effective, safe, and scalable manner. That's what uh, we call it, Ariaka, as um, Ariaka AI Perform. We launched that a uh, few weeks ago. Uh, we are in the process of bringing out Ariaka AI Secure and Ariaka AI Observe, so that over time, just as for the network as a service and for SASE, unified SASE as a service, we have all the layers and the elements of um, uh, performance, agility, uh, security, right, and observability for security and networking. We do the same now for AI on a global level. So that's the power of unified SASE as a service from Ariaka and uh, Ariaka AI Perform, Ariaka AI Secure, and Ariaka AI Observe over a period of time. Mm -hmm.